Fiendip.com. Hit me up. I'm just saying. You know, uh, there's some things I was just thought about today. You remember, y'all, y'all remember the movie Evil Dead, right? You know, it was a good movie, you know. But, you know, if you ever had one of these books, would you really understand what the fuck it's trying to say? Ooh, look, it says Book of the Dead. Look, you see it? Oh, I didn't know that. It didn't look like it when I first looked at it. But I'm just saying. But uh, I'm, I'm going to show you some other stuff in here that might not you might not be able to understand. Do not get this book because you might just get freaked out. Look, see, like I said. Words that don't understand. What do you see? Nothing but skulls. That's bad business. Oh, that's the wrong side. Skulls. All bad. Bad. Bad business. Just saying. Who makes a book like this? I mean, the movie was kind of, you know, corny, you know? And now the dude, you know what he does now? He plays on Burn Notice, the fat sidekick. Wow. With the Hawaiian t-shirts on. Oh, God. You're doing so good, Bruce, whatever your name is. You know, he would have been better off being Bruce Banner disappearing like the Incredible Hulk did. I'm just saying. Obama, I'm trying to tell y'all, I'm tired of y'all trying to blame Obama for shit. It's not his fault. W, George W. B. That's the problem. I'm sorry. I'm just letting you know. George W. B. is the problem is. That man messed up eight years. This man's trying to fix, y'all are saying he's fix it him. Four. Really? I mean, really? Re-elect him. Re-elect him. Give him a chance. And then, then you get hated on Bill Clinton. Why? Because he got his wing of ass to suck. So what? Who cares? At least he was doing a damn job. We were not in debt. Now, America's in all kinds of debt. It's all fucked up. Real bad. We're so far in debt with China. We might as well be over there making rice and roni. I'm just saying, we're in some trouble. We need to get it together. Get it together. Don't blame it on Obama. It's not his fault. He's trying. Give him a break. Just saying. And there's some other shit that's been pissing me off lately. Like Twick and Twitch or whatever his name is. He ain't been playing no good music lately. I've been rather disappointed. And I'm still mad about the damn WWE tickets that I should have got in the first place if he hadn't left me on hold for so damn long. And it missed some bullshit. And then he hung up on me. And he's like, I was called him back. He said, oh, somebody hung up on you? And I said, yeah. And the next thing I know, I heard nothing but the dial tone. I know what that means. You hung up on me again, you sap sucking that so beep, beep. But I'm just saying, you know, you need to give a nigga a shout out. I'm just saying. Hit me up on the Tosh.0. Why can't I be on this show? You put pants on the ground, looking like a fool with the pants on the ground on there. He's about, what, 100? What? About 100 years old? What? I'm in my prime. I'm in the Andy Murphy. Charlie Murphy. Superstar status. Disco Inferno. Whatever. You know, I'm in that prime. I'm the time. www.beendup.com. Just saying. Hit that up. YouTube me up at beendup.com. You know, you got to do that. Hit me up. 